Welcome to Windows 8 tutorial lesson number 4. In this tutorial I'm going to show you how to rearrange applications within a group. I'm going to show you how to change the name of your groups or apply a name to a specific group within your start menu metro interface. And I'm also going to show you how to rearrange or change the positioning of your groups within the metro interface. So let's go ahead and get started. First thing I'm going to show you how to do is rearrange your applications within a group. So let's say that, for example, uh, this weather application at the bottom here is something that's really important to me and it's something that I want to see immediately when I first come into the program. Well, I would probably double left click and drag that to the top because I want it to be at the top level. So it's something that I see right away when I come into the application. And let's say that also photos are really important to me. It's something that I need to see right away because I'm a photographer. That's not true, but for the sake of this tutorial, let's say that I am a photographer. So I would double left click and I would drag that to the top. And then when I come into the start menu from now on, the first two applications that I'll see is photos and the weather. Now let me show you an example of what will happen if you try to drag one of these smaller applications that have a smaller panel into a different position. And I'm just going to double left click and drag it around. And you'll notice that sometimes it forces applications to go into a different location. In this case everything stays even, but if I move it here it forces one of my applications to go out towards the side. So I would, if I were you, I would kind of move the, app, the application around until you find a good positioning that keeps everything e equal and even. So what I would do is, just, like I said, just kind of move that around and until you find a place for it where it doesn't cause distortion. Um, I would place it in that location. But if you had to, I would just first drop that application. Let me go back. I accidentally went out of my interface. I would go ahead and drag the Sky, Sky Drive application up there. And then everything is equal again. So you might have to play around a little bit with the applications if it's one of the smaller squares until you get everything balanced out. And you'll have to do that a little bit until you get everything organized. So it's a little bit of a learning curve, but it's pretty fairly straightforward and it shouldn't be that complicated for you. But as you can see, I still have the photos and the weather application at the top here. So let's move on to the next task. Next thing I want to show you is how to change the name of your application groups. So let's go ahead and go to the bottom right hand corner and you'll see a minus icon there and you'll left click on that and it'll zoom out of the Metro interface start menu. And I'm going to change the, the name of this first group here that I named Metro Apps and I'll right click on that and you'll see that it has a check mark box there indicating that we selected this first group. And also you'll notice at the bottom of our screen we have a name group option and if you left click on that, it'll bring up a panel where we can change the name. And instead of calling it Metro Apps, I'll just call it Metro. And we'll just use that as a short name. And if you left click on the name icon, it'll now name it Metro. But let's say that we wanted to give this second group a name that doesn't have a name. We would right click on that. And again, you'll see the check mark, check mark box there indicating that it's selected and then we'll have the name group at the bottom here again. Left click on that, click in this box that says name this group of tiles and we'll give it a name. I'll call it finances since it has some finance applications within that group. So I'll call it finance apps and then I'll click the name icon and that'll finalize everything. The next thing I want to do is show you how to rearrange or change the positioning of your groups or your group of tile tiles or group of applications whatever you want to call it I tend to call it group of applications so I'm going to take the office applications and I'm going to double left click and drag that towards the front and let's assume that Microsoft Office applications are really important it should be the first thing in my group so we'll put it there and you can do that with any group you just double left click it and drag it left or right to the position that you want to place it. But I'm going to reorganize my applications back to the way that I had them because I feel that they're more important in the order that I had them already. So I'm going to rearrange that some more and place things how they need to be. So once you're done making your changes, you would just left click on any group. And you, in my opinion, I would click on the group that you're going to use because it's going to zoom in on that specific group. So that's how you rearrange applications in a group. 
That's how you change the names of your group or apply a group name. And that's also how you rearrange or change the groups in terms of its positioning within your Metro interface. So I hope this tutorial was helpful for teaching how to use Windows 8. And if it was, give us thumbs up, you know, subscribe, embed, and share a video, leave a comment. And I hope that you stay tuned for future tutorials on Windows 8. Have a great day.